So this is going in our fantastic chocolate banana waffle Napoleon. Oh, now this is quite a recipe. Oh, these look beautiful. What we'll do is just leave those to cool down for a little while. Now do these stay separate or should they? They will all stay just like this for the moment and then later on we'll, uh, we'll deep fry them. Oh, so this is a way to make a crispy nut. Yes. Fantastic. So we'll let those sit those for a side for a while. Should I mix up the waffle okay, batter? What we're doing is yes, we're starting the waffle batter, which is going to be one and a half cups of the all-purpose flour and uh, one and a half teaspoons of baking powder. Okay. Okay, so one and a half. Correct. Yes. Then half a teaspoon of the baking soda. Okay. And half a teaspoon of the salt we add to that. Oh, okay. That's most of our dry ingredients. We can just whisk, whisk those together yeah, a little see, bit. Yeah, see, that's good. I love whisking because it really is sifting. Right, yeah, correct. To that, then, we add our wet ingredients, which is one and a half cups of buttermilk. A great fat breakfast. That's it. <laughs> it's really and no eggs in the with. waffle? We add two eggs and six tablespoons of melted uh, unsalted butter oh, to okay. that, just to so, cream it in. So two eggs? Yes. This is a fluffy Very simple, waffle. very fluffy, nice and light. I can see that it's a very nice consistency. It really is great. And we have the melted butter right here. Six tablespoons? Six tablespoons of melted butter, yes. Okay. Just hold that for you. Great. All incorporated. Mm -hmm. This is very simple, very easy to follow, actually. Oh, good. Right, and then we just pop that straight in our waffle machine, just spray it a little bit to Oh, okay. So even though it's a non-stick, spray it anyway? Yes, yes. Okay. It's always better to be safe and sorry. I'd like a cup or...? Right. Okay. Just so it's a nice big waffle. So I'll cook two waffles and you... Okay, so that's done. Great. I'll check the waffle. Okay. Oh, beautiful. That's perfect. A little crispy. Mm -hmm. I'll make another. Now, I was taught with waffles to do this. Do you walk around the kitchen doing this? <laughs> I don't have time, unfortunately. I wish I did. <laughs> because it keeps it crispy. Okay, for the finishing, and we're going to take, yes, four bananas in total. Oh, okay. And just slice them about a quarter inch. I'll do four for you. So if I... Actually, let me get my frying pan started. Okay, I'll do this. Great. If you want to finish those I will. off, I will. Now, this is where the brown sugar butter comes in handy. I'm going to melt about... Tablespoon of that. We need and to melt. the chocolate, how much chocolate is that? We're melting a quarter cup of a bittersweet uh, Valrhona chocolate, which is basically for the, just for the finishing touches. Now the bananas are going in here? We're going to add the bananas first. You want the pan to be fairly hot so you get the nice color from the uh, brown sugar butter. Uh oh, that, and, must, uh, be, that must be a, a waffle, waffle, waffle finishing. Machine. What a nasty noise. There. Okay. Just going to give those a little. Oh, they look pretty. Oh, so not a bit too more much. Color. You don't use too much of that brown butter. It's I'll get the other waffle. Just for the flavor. Thank you. Can add a little bit more butter to that, actually. I skimped a bit. Just to really give it a good flavor. Mm. Okay, you see just a little color coming into them. So now we can add, actually, the nuts to that. Those. Now I should cut these in half? Those you can cut there straight in half and set one on each plate. For the, the base. Okay. All of the nuts. All of the nuts go in. We're going to flambe. Ooh, just add a little so shot of the. Just like a half a cup. A shot, that's it. Perfect. Perfect. Ooh. Just let that <laughs> light up. I love that. Just let the alcohol burn off. And there we go. We just put our quarter of the mixture on each base of the waffle. Well, you better be hungry if you order this. Oh, yes. No small portions in normal. And now this goes over? Yes, we place the other half on top and just top it again with the final half of each. Mm. And then to that, if you'd like to finish it with the uh, confectioner's sugar, just all around. And then that's where the chocolate comes in handy with the final touches. 